one thing about the promises of God. He will never go back on his word. And he promised us that our lives will be sweet someday. That means while we go through the trials and tribulations of life, the pain, the agony, the frustrations, not to fret, not to be dismayed, because He promised us, because there is a judgment day, that our lives will be sweeter. We don't know when it is. But that's all right. If we can just hold on just a little while longer, I want my grandmother to live with blood that said, you can just hold on. She said, child, if you can just hold on just a little while longer, everything will be all right. We have a problem of looking at others and how they blossom. We have a problem of looking at others, how their lives are deteriorating, and we look at ourselves. But we gotta stop looking at others. We gotta look at the Lord. Because that's where our strength really comes from. Because one thing about Israel with none of me. 
So I gave them up in their own parts of us that they walked in their own councils. Oh, that my people had hearkened to me. And Israel had walked in my ways. I should soon have subdued their enemies and turned my hand against our adversaries. From those verses and other verses, we like to speak of this thought. Lord, not Lord, but Lord, Lord, L-A-R-D, Lord, is received. I'm going to say that again because I, I want to make sure we get this. Lord, not L-O-R-D, Lord, as the maker, as our king, the king, but Lord is received. I'm going to say that one more time. Lord is greasy. Have mercy right now, Lord. Father God, in the name of Jesus, speak to thy people, speak to thy the vessel. As we run the a word that you put in our heart. Again, we don't speak of our sin, but they speak of us. But we speak by your voice, by your spirit. That we submit ourselves, totally submit ourselves into you. That we adhere to that voice and to that Holy Spirit. That we may speak with power and authority. Only that you can give, God. And that we in time now that we can understand your word, God. And maybe we can just have some understanding that we can live according to your righteousness. So touch us right now. Touch those that are here. Touch those that are all over. Touch those that are just listening right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. That we receive the word from you today. And once we receive this word of God, that we will glorify the mighty name of Jesus. These and all the lessons we have in our son Jesus' name in your prayer. Amen. Amen. Amen.
it was still there. Now, how could God have been sending it?
and tell them how much he loved them. And that you love them. And anything that you love, anyone you love, you, 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 you chastise them. You, you tell them the, the correct information. You, you can't just keep letting them get away with stuff because at some time or another, it's going to backfire on them. Amen. He says, sing aloud to God, just me. Make a joyful noise unto God of Jesus. Take a song and bring it to him. In other words, play music. Brother Carl, rejoice in the Lord. In the midst of all that's going on. He said, for this was a statute, a rule, a regulation, guidance for Israel and a law of God of Jacob. These are the laws of God. I've heard your pride. I've heard different things that have gone on. But joy, make joy in the Lord. Praise the Lord. He said, don't you remember thou callest in trouble when you were in trouble and I delivered thee. In other words, even in the midst of those things, even in the midst of things that we don't do right, even how we are, God still said, even then I still took care of thee. Thank you, Lord. He said, I delivered thee. I don't want anyone to leave your computer, whatever, wherever you're watching this right now, thinking that it's because you've done all that was good. That everything is based on you, you've done so good. No, man.
that you haven't opened up yet. What you afraid of? I said it all. That's what I'm afraid of. I'm afraid of the one that controls life and death and, and, and hope just turning. That's who I'm afraid of. That's why I haven't opened up just yet. And he hasn't spent the time that we need to open up just yet. He said, keep preaching the word. When you have a leader to say something, Show how holy ghost. 
sell more importantly. And they walked in their own counsel. They had their own judgment. They had the pre preconceived judgment on others and on themselves. But all of them, them, them were glad that they could give the clothes that did this him. He said, even though they did me wrong. And I gave them up because that's what they wanted to do. Because see, what they were 
get by the bedside crying. Never thought years later, 40 years later, that I'll end up preaching based on what we deal with right now. Water hoses, dumping water, but that green water. It's the old folk knew something. And if they told you to do something, you better do it. See, a disobedient child coming up with him. The word didn't know change whether, whether you and I like it or not. It's going to be what it's going to be. We are acting like hard headed little children, a step in people. We don't follow them. God. Second Kings. Elisha. We're dealing with man. Elisha sent a message to Naaman's house. Naaman was a leper. And he didn't want to be cleansed. He wanted to be healed. He wanted to be made whole. And the messenger, by way of Elisha, told Naaman to go to the church and wash seven times. And you'll be clean. You'll be home. Naaman puts on a pity party. Puts on a fit. Complain. Why? Why couldn't he come to tell me? Why couldn't I go powerful? Yeah, that better bills that I can go to to be clean. And his own servant had to tell him. He said, look, and if you paraphrase, he said, look, he said, he didn't tell you anything hard to do. All he told you to do was very simple is to go to the church. And watch them tell you. All the folks I asked him was to put on a mask. We were around folk. That's all they asked us to do. This is not political. This is not partisan. This is trying to save lives. I believe it is. 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 I believe it
26, I believe it is. 2016, I'm sorry, 2016. When he told me, I feel the word of the Lord came out here, just go in and shut the door. Tell my right pains. So this is in the Bible. We, we, this has happened before. Church of Israel over the Egypt land. This has happened before. We just have to be careful and trust in God. Hey, Romans 10, 19 said, You confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus. Believe in your heart that God will raise from the dead. That shall be saved. With the heart and believe in the Christ. With the mouth confession is made into salvation. So wherever you are, you can, you can turn your life over to the Lord. Wherever you are, wherever you're watching this thing, it's when you're ready to say it.
Keep us near the cross. In the name. 